Hi guys, uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We have revamped it a little bit. Uh, there's a new display picture and a new banner, and hopefully new videos from now on. So today, I'm going to be showing you how I made my YouTube intro. Um, long time coming, past couple of months, didn't really get time to work on it, but um, it's finally done now. Could have been better, of course, but it is what it is. And for now, we'll be using it because we cannot keep pausing everything else for the sake of one thing. So let me show you how I made my YouTube intro. Here is the process. Enjoy. Okay, hey guys. So uh, I wanted to show you this thing that I made recently. It's basically a girl. My CDs have always been very illustrated and this new one will be no different. But what I'm also going to do is animate this uh, illustration for my YouTube intro. This looks wonderful, I'm very happy with it. But first, like, what do I want it to do? So I want this coffee to have that wisp, you know, going like whoosh, like ooh, look at the warm coffee. Ooh, have a blinking, slow blink. I want the cat to start on the floor, walk here, look up, right, and then just jump directly there, although she'd probably jump here and then there. Maybe go round and round once um, and then and then sit down here all snug like a bug. I think that is extensive animation that we will not be able to do. So far I tried to animate only the wisp of smoke or I forgot, what is it called? It is Steam! Steam is the name. Name, yes. I'm looking at smoke animation tutorials over here. And um, this is not what I want, but I understand how this can help me. You start from a small point, you stretch it out, you make... Anyway, I get it. So right now, what I did was really bad. I'll show you. Uh -huh -huh. This is what I have so far. It's pretty bad. Basically just duplicated the original smoke layer and uh, steam, steam layer and um, just, you know, try to make it pretend to be moving. So, that's bad. So we're gonna stop this. Let's rename this to original and rename this to um, base. Yeah. So we want to make a base layer where we can animate different elements. We have multiple cats that are walking into the frame and then jumping directly up onto the armchair. Now what you have to do is make sure that all of the cats that have been drawn look similar. So the patterns, the colors, if their paw is black and their ear is white, make sure you do that for every single movement of the cat so that people understand that this is the same cat and continuity isn't broken. There were a lot of issues that I faced while making this. Um, most of all, procrastination, uh, but also, um, since this was my first time animating, I didn't really know what I was doing. Of course, Procreate made it much easier to get done. That was our process. Hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Bye!